Hey, 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 hey. So, I've said a bunch of times, Thor's great against tanks, right? Uh, especially tanks before Siege moves out. Thor's are... It's hard to get a lot of them. Um, it's hard to, uh, to to do reasonable things with them. Uh, they're particularly strong when you make some and then you haven't made any for a while and then you do an attack uh, because you've been spending all your money on other stuff. Uh, because the just $500 expense and the slow walking speed of Thor's makes it so that trying to walk across the field and attack with them, it guarantees that you're going to have a smaller army than your opponent. So you're going for the three Thor push, which is something I've done a bunch of times and I kind of enjoyed. But one thing to, to note about the three por Thor push uh, is that it's it's kind of hard countered by infantry with stim. And this guy has infantry with stim. So you, know, you, you get to kind of lose. Uh, right? So that's just kind of a problem, man. Um, I know it, it. there's a lot of strategies where it's decent no matter what happens, and this just isn't one of them. If your opponent gets a primarily infantry-based army with Stin, you're just going to get crushed, and it wasn't even close. So... Uh, I don't have any advice of, of what to do better, uh, with making Thors and attacking with them. I mean, you made three Thors, you attacked with them, you brought SCVs, that's all good. Uh, you just gotta kinda get an idea of what your opponent is doing a lot quicker after your first Thor, and then decide whether or not to make your second Thor. Because, um, if they are clearly going for racks with Tech Lab, and especially multiple racks, like three racks like this, you should just not be attacking with your Thors. Because uh, Marauders and Marines with Stim dominate the crap out of Thors. So another thing to, to take note of is that at 10 minutes you only had $2,300. This is pretty common for a Thor build. Because uh, this factory by itself is able to spend 500 bucks a minute. Um, and this reactor, I mean, no, this uh, Rax is able to spend 250 So th th these two buildings together can spend every penny you get off of one base. Uh, so you don't need any other buildings to, to, to spend money, uh, to spend all your money. Um, but you end up with more money. And you can't really spend it without either getting more buildings, which is like expense that, that doesn't make a lot of sense, or uh, building like bunker, turret, turret, uh, tech lab, and, and getting an upgrade here, and getting an engineering bay, and getting another command center. So like, you you can only make one Thor every minute, and you have a bunch of extra minerals uh, on top of that, but you don't have any extra gas. So you either got to make Hellions, or you got to make unupgraded Marines in order to have a reasonable army size uh, when moving forward in the game. Or you can make a really quick command center and start taking additional gold and get a second factory making Thors. That works too. But basically, my point is that uh, your attack is $1,500 at 10 minutes, and that is horrible. That's just horribly, horribly, horrible. Because the 10-minute benchmark is 3500 or 4000 if you're if you're all inning off one base. Uh, and $3,500 is a lot more than 15. Uh, it's it's double, more than double. It's it's 2.25 times or something like that. So there's just no chance that at 10, 11 minutes you can walk up with $1,500 and do anything useful, especially against somebody who happened to make units that counter your units really well. So when I make Thors, it works best when my opponent attacks me. And if he doesn't attack me, uh, I, I need to make some other unit, like Hellions or Marines, and, and go attack him with those units as well as the Thors. You can't just take three Thors and go attack with them. That's not a valid push. It's... Especially at 11 minutes, three Thors is just not nearly enough army to do anything. So I'm, I've said a million times, composition is important, but it's not nearly as important as just how much money you contribute to the fight. And this fight, he he just had more than double your uh, your dollar dollar dollars contributed. Um, also, how did you? Okay, here we go. So obviously his army is bigger than yours by 500. But on top of that, you've got four marines back home, you've got a Hellion not contributing to the fight, and you've got a Thor walking across the field, so his army is more than twice as big as yours. Uh, let's look at units lost, man. I mean, money lost, not units lost. 
So even though his army was way bigger than yours, you only came out behind by about 400, and that's, you know, that's part of how sexy uh, Thor SCV is. But losing all those SCVs means you're at 29 back home, which is full saturation on one base. It's not the end of the world. So you can imagine that ev when he has W and it comes out almost even, if you had the same amount as him, it would have worked great, right? <laughs> all right. Uh, I don't think he stimmed. Which is a little weird. I mean, what makes infantry really good against Thor's is how well Stim synergizes with the universe, and he didn't even use it. So, bam. You you lost purely based on him having a lot more than you, rather than losing to something as as weird as oh, Stim is really good against Thor's. Um, yeah. So if you could cut out this turret, sa salvage this bunker before you push, and spend all the money in your bank, and then push it 10 minutes with uh, three Thors and, you know, 25 Marines, or or three Thors and, and 10 Hellions, that'd be 2,500. So four Thors and 10 Hellions would be uh, 30, 3,000. So, you know, 10 Hellions, four Thors, $3,000. That, that'd be nice, right? You're, the the point is, anytime you're making a 10 minute attack, it has to be $3,500 or more, or else there's no point in doing it. So, uh, yeah. Thors are good when they attack you, and if they don't, you can just take Expos and use your Thors to defend and then transition into something, or whatever. Uh, I don't know what to tell you. Obviously, you just needed more money. Bye.